Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video. This is Eman and you're watching Gaming Amigos. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to tell you how you can fix the infinite loading screen error in your GTA 5. Okay, so if you guys are interested to fix this error, like I, I know you are, you want to fix that because you are not able to play that game. So yes, stick to my video till the very end. And without wasting any time, let's jump into the video. okay guys so i have three solutions for you okay so let me show you the first one okay so first one you have to do is just go and change your game config okay so where is your game config come to your open iv add it mode okay then go on mods then update update rpf common data okay so this is the game config and all you have to do is just replace with the original i mean the latest game config okay so if you guys don't know how to fix that you can watch this video i've shown every single thing and the second method is you have to come to your home screen of your you know uh, gta 5 and then you have to you know again check and update the uh, heap limit adjuster pack file limit adjuster and i guess it was ha huh, yeah script hook 5.net and this might fix your error and yes if even your game is not working after doing all of this then this is going to be very long video yeah okay so now lots of youtubers will suggest you to uninstall your mods folder okay now this is so pathetic like you have invested so much time in the in installing the mods and now you have to uninstall all of them like this is bullshit man okay so i have a greater idea than that you don't have to uninstall every single mod but only few of them and yes those are oivs and yes uh, not every oivs like a uh, replaced one uh, for example like loading screen is causing the error load if you have replaced a loading scene or if you have replaced the billboards in my case it was billboards who were causing this error okay so now i will tell you how to do so and yes the billboards were oivs so i will tell you how to uninstall oiv if uh, if there is a uh, not an installation file in the rr okay so now just open that okay so now let me just tell you this is my uh you know real billboard uh, the mode i have installed now all you have to do is just go to here and these are all of these mods okay so this took me literally so much time for like 10 to 15 minutes <laughs> i mean that's too much time and now it will be like oiv dot oiv now just right click on that file i'm talking about the billboards and the loading screen or the oivs that you have to uninstall that you might think that are causing the error so yeah just watch this okay so just right click on the oiv then click on view file okay this will pop up and now over here you have to see this uh assam.xml this is the file you have to open this and this will tell you the path of the you know the mod they have installed okay so this is the path and this is the source now let me tell you it says x for x64 l okay now we will go into the uh yes yes let me tell you that we don't have to go into the mods folder okay we have to search in the uh, gta5 folder like we have to search that over here because these are the original file and we have to replace the original file with the mods file now l yes l x64 l we have to open that and then it will show you show in mods folder and you don't have to click that now now you have to go to levels gta5 okay levels gta5 then ctw then airport okay airport and then these are the files a uh, ap1 uh, ap111111 yes open this and these are the files which have to be replaced but but you have to understand everything we don't have to do this we don't have to select all of these instead we will select this 
we will go back and we will select this and we will copy and paste this over here just like this drag and drop that okay so this is our <coughs> file and now all you, do, all you have to do is just go to the uh, mods folder click over here and then drag and drop this over here yes where you, you are good to go the file has been replaced okay so you have to do the same thing with the other other areas in my there are literally lots of areas and yes i have done all of them like mostly all of them not every single one of them but yes it fixed my error this was the um, method i used uh, to run my gts gta 5 not gta 6 <laughs> And yes, GTA 6, I have purchased my PlayStation just for GTA 6, just to make videos for you guys, you know. So yes, make sure to subscribe to my channel <coughs> uh, and do not miss any of my video. Those are literally so useful. This one was also useful. I mean, uh, you will literally fix your error, fix that infinite loading screen. And most of the time, the uh, loading screen will fix on the game config, uh, you know, step so yes i hope you enjoyed this video i hope your error is fixed and i hope you are enjoying your game so see you guys in my next video and goodbye